So we're going to look at the uh, navigation function on the X-Flight Autopilot today. Uh, this allows it to receive and execute missions from your mobile device, uh, either Android or iPad, and um, follow missions that you set up in the Q Ground Control app. We'll cover the uh, Q Ground Control setup uh, in a moment, but first of all, I'll show you the uh, autopilot function. You switch it on in the usual way. And uh, now it's ready for one of the flight control modes. In this case, we'll select nav. And you see it turns an olive color, which means it's ready to receive a uh, flight plan from the app and uh, for the app to initiate that mission. So I'll initiate the mission from the app. And you see it turns green, and so it's now executing the the app following the waypoints uh, that you've set up. So this is the uh, Q Ground Control app, and um, it's available for Android and iOS. And so we're going to set up a mission or a flight plan here now. So tap on the A B path icon there, and. Uh, here we can now select a waypoint to start the mission. Note the uh, start mission box here where you can set the altitude. You can set the altitude for each waypoint. So click the plus button there and then tap on the map twice and we can set our planned home position P there. Um, to activate a waypoint you just click tap on it and so the first waypoint will have off to the south there and then the um, click on the menu there for the waypoint and you can add a or insert a waypoint in between we'll have that one going off to the coast and then if you go to mission start you'll see a return to launch which is where you start the mission from and you can uh, close the loop by ret return to launch button there. Um, there's a file option here so you can save that mission or you can load existing ones. Once the mission has been loaded or defined you then have to upload it to the flight controller. It's very quick so now that mission has been sent to the autopilot. So once you've defined the mission or loaded the mission, uh, you can execute it uh, by going into flight mode here. Uh, you'll also see some uh, information here. Uh, these are configurable so you can set up uh, different values in there to keep track of. It uh, works out wind direction and wind speed for you as well, which I have set up. And there's also um, a HRS and compass there. So to execute this mission, the action icon there, start mission. Sometimes there's a swipe there to confirm it. Start mission. And there's the start mission swipe. Auto flight mode. So now we're in the flight mode, and the autopilot will follow that mission.